Okay, so first of all, I was gonna show you how I do my nails because this is so funny, but I, cause I'm not a nail professional, but I get questions about gel nails so often that I think it's like, I feel like it's like, you know, the people who are not professionals are the ones asking questions. Cause it's like, they're like, oh, they can trust a not professional. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, so I was just gonna show you how I do it. It's, it honestly is really so easy. So first things first, I always clip my nails and I just did the Tweezerman ones cause I feel like Tweezerman is just always a brand that I can trust. Like I love their tweezers. But the thing I liked about these tweezers is the big set is straight. Why is the, that important? Well, when like it's curved, like when it's curved like this, um, and you're trying to do like your big toes, like I feel like it curves in on your big, on your big toes. So I like to use the, the um, Tweezerman ones so they don't have a curve to it. The, the, the big one is straight. Holy cow, I'm struggling with words. Okay, so there's that. The next thing is I feel like you need cuticle nippers and um, I put these actually and then this these because it was $5.99 because it came with like your little um, cuticle pushers and then the nippers all at the same time but this is the one that I have is I just bought this and it's $3.99 so if you don't need the cuticle nippers you could just get this one and it's $3.99 but it has this but the other thing is is I'll use my the other side to help like scratch off some of like leftover nail stuff um, okay, this is another thing. If you want to, to do your nails the correct way is you're supposed to soak them with, um, oh my gosh, why can't I think of what it's called now? Acetone. acetone. Um, so, you, so you can like put acetone on um, cotton swabs and then put foil over it. I've had acetone in a bowl and then I'll just soak my nails in it. But how I actually usually do it is I just peel my nails off and that's Terrible, I know, but honestly, it doesn't ruin my nails. And I think it's because I, they don't like, they're not stuck on like they are if I go to a salon. So when I do them myself, they stick on perfectly for a week and then I can peel them off. But anyway, so that's what I like to do. Okay, next up um, are the, the little buffers because I like to like smooth out my nails. And if you have a problem with your nails um, lifting or like it just doesn't stick very well, use a buffer and I think that just helps get like the oils off of your nails. Oh, Gentry's over here. I thought you were gonna tell me something. <laughs> um, okay, anyways, so use a little buffer. That'll help smooth it out. Also, if you like happen to peel your nails and there's like any little hangy parts, you can just like buffer that off. So I put those there. That has like your nail files, your buffers, all in that thingy. Okay, then this one is the one that I have and I love it, but I'm also gonna link you, if you wanna buy the whole kit, I, that's going to be an option here too. The reason why I like this one though, um, is it has the set timers on it. So you can do it for five seconds, 30 seconds, or 60 seconds. And then it automatically senses your nails when you're in there. There's like a little bottom piece that slides in here. I think maybe not on this one anyways, but I don't, I take them out anyways. Okay. But I'm going to do my pretend do my nails for you. I won't do it cause it will take too long for a live, but I'm going to show you how I do it to save time. So, Okay, so this is the light that I use. It's on sale for $35 too. So I'm just giving you all the things that you will probably need. Okay, and then this, you guys, this is the new set that I just barely got. And the colors, um, are you worried about the UV skin damage? I've seen videos of people getting skin cancer on their hands because you know what? I haven't, and but they do make, um, they make little gloves you can put on your, on your hands and I have that linked on my profile. You can look at that. So if you're worried a bit about getting UV rays, but this is um, UV LED. I don't know if that's not as bad because I've had other lights where they're, I think they were just UV and it would um, get hotter and stuff. But this, maybe, maybe this is just as bad, but I haven't had any issues and I haven't noticed like any freckles or different things on my hands. But um, if that makes you nervous, then just get the gloves and then they're linked on my bio and then it leaves out your little fingers so that you can just paint your nails. Anyway, so there's an option for that too. Okay, so, but I have to show you these colors because they're so good and they're perfect for fall. So um, this color is, an, is like an old OPI color. It's called Espresso Your Inner Self. But, and this is where I wanna give you, kind of show you the difference in the nail polish. So this is only sold at the beauty supplies and I wanna say it was $20 for this one bottle. 
This pack, you get 24 pieces for $24.99. So here's the thing too. This is the bottle size compared to this bottle size. So you can see this is quite a bit bigger. Um, gosh, I don't even know how many ounces or whatever. Seven mLs and this is 15 mLs. So it's double the size or this is double the size of these, but you're getting 24 for almost the same price. But they had a lot of really similar colors. So there's this brown, but they're so, they're so good. And then they have like some with shimmer in them. Let me show you here. So you can see like, see how it's got that pretty shimmer. So you could do like this color, do your brown and then do this shimmer on top. And that would be so pretty for fall. I know people like to do like the little glazes on top. So that would be another fun one. And it's, this is all in that same, in this kit that I have highlighted. I thought that one was pretty too. And then, I don't know. So just some really fun colors here. They also have your um, top coat and your base coat and then um, a matte top coat. So if you don't, I actually prefer them shiny. I feel like whenever they're matte, they, um, I, I swear it like attracts other colors. It, they don't, I don't know why. I just, I don't love the matte, but they have the matte in there as an option if you want that. And then the nail primer. I actually never use the nail primer either, but if you have issues with it, the nail polish lifting, use the nail primer. So I just use base coat and then I use the top coat. So actually let's go through the process before I get too carried away. Actually, let me show you these other colors first too. So these are the colors that I had over the summer. And I thought those were really pretty colors too. And then um, this was another one. Wait a second. The price went down. It's normally $62 and this has the light and everything with it. Okay. So that might be a really good deal to get this one right here. Okay. Just saying that just went on sale. Or at least I just noticed it just going on sale. Okay. Let's go back to these because that's what I'm going to pretend to do. So when I do my nails, I trim them first. Then I use my little cuticle pusher, clean up around the edges, and then I'll buff them out, you know, and then, um, and then I go through and then I get my base coat and you paint your base coat. I paint all 10 nails, you guys. And then this is where my trick happens. Okay, wait, will you hold this so I can show how I do it? Okay, so I put, Gentry's gonna help hold that. Okay, so I put my hands like this, and then I put them inside. Wait, let's go like this. Okay. Like this. Okay, however, like. <laughs> so people can see, okay. you know, and then I put them in like that. So then all 10 nails are getting done at the same time. And I know that sounds, dumb but you don't want to just do one hand and then you have to wait for a full minute and then one hand and wait for a full minute because you have to do those for the base coat the color coat usually i do two color coats sometimes i do three color coats and then a top coat so you're saving yourself five minutes by painting all 10 and then putting them in like that is that so smart okay um let's see and then okay so then i do the base coat then i do the, the three color coats and then i do the top coat and then um, I usually buy the little cotton rounds just because it's easier and they, they're less linty than like a cotton ball. So that's why I like those. These are $2 and I figured if you're grabbing everything else. Okay, this is what I'm actually just ordering and I wish I would have had it to do this because I have just like a regular bottle of rubbing alcohol. So after you get done with your top coat, you want to put, um, good to know, although I usually do one hand then the other while watching Bachelor. Oh. If you're watching Bachelor, you could just do one hand. Actually, though, you could pay more attention because you could just go like this. Well, I don't need to pay attention either. Right? Okay, so then, but I thought this was such a good idea because it's the kind of um, alcohol thing. So you get your little cotton round and then just go bloop, bloop, bloop. And then you can wipe off all your nails because you need alcohol afterwards to wipe. It's, there's like this like weird gooey, like not gooey, kind of gooey though, you know, that you just want to wipe off. So that... And you guys, that's how you do your nails. I can literally do my nails in like 10 to 15 minutes, probably closer to 10, but I'll just say 15. That's how fast it is. You just paint them, bloop, paint them, bloop, and then put the alcohol. Oh, you didn't know about the alcohol. Yes, that's why, wait, did you not feel the gooiness afterwards? I just feel like 
that's you have you have to use the rubbing alcohol afterwards so that's why i wanted to put that key and that's a cute container and then you can just put it in your box with all your things you know like i have a little thing that i'll just put all my nail stuff in and then i just pull it out and then i'll just do my nails so the thing is um okay hang on here i need caitlin's hyping you up oh crap okay so okay <laughs> caitlin thank you so much caitlin okay so now I just got sidetracked, but that is the alcohol thing. So that is all your nail stuff and your nails are done. Okay. Now moving on, I wanted to link this shirt because that's what I'm wearing today. And I feel like if, whenever it has this little triangle right here so that, you know, it's like a sleeveless shirt and it's cute because you want this like little panel here, but then that way it doesn't show your bra or anything else. So that's why I like this one. And it will still be cute for under like flannels and stuff like that. So you can go like hot weather to cold weather and wear it as an undershirt for cold weather. Okay. And then this is the one I teased on Instagram and my sister called me. She's like, not me. Are you already trying to buy this before you go up, go on your live? But look how cute this is. I'm telling you, it reminds me of free people stuff and it's $32.99. So it has a really good neckline. Okay. Here's the thing. I feel like I don't love when things are too, too tight on me. And like this neckline, look how cute it is. Let me move my hair. You know, it's like a, just a good neckline. And then it's got the drop shoulders. It's, see this like, um, it's like an unfinished edges right there. But I thought that was really cute. And then this is the length of it. And then I'm gonna, how it has like the cute little slits right there. It drops down in the back. So it'll be so cute with your, um, boots it'll be cute with your leggings all the things this just dropped which i can't wait to tell you this because somebody on instagram okay wait actually i can't go for it i have to tell you i have to go in order first so then this is another one it's this two-piece set it's let me just show you how cute it is hang on i'm gonna grab it and put it on for you because i know you're dying to see okay the fabric is like really good um like a silk oh I got a size medium in the um in that sweatshirt and I always wear mediums I feel like so I'd say it's true to size if you don't want it too baggy you could totally size down but I felt like a medium okay this is also a medium this is a set and if you watched my Instagram yesterday my friend Gosha was actually wearing it too it's so funny she goes Betsy you have to see the cutest outfit I got I'm like I literally just bought the same one it's so funny we bought the same thing except for she had like a purple color and I bought this tan color, just cause I always like tans and browns and all of that. But the neckline is so cute on it. See how it just like comes over your shoulders, but it's a short sleeve. It would be so cute to wear like over gym clothes. Look how cute these are too. And then they have pockets. I love the fabric. Yes, the material on this, it's literally like butter. Okay, okay. There's one, one thing that's a tiny bit better than this. Well, but it's completely different. But when you said smooth like butter, it just reminded me of this other one that I also included on this live. So I got the other one in a gray color. Let me just show you. Let me click on it first. This. I bought it in the gray color. I had ordered this white and the white just came in. You guys, the white is so good. Okay. 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 Look, Kate. Kate. It's, it has a sheen to it because it's so, I don't even know. Why are you laughing? <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. It has like a sheen to the fabric. So it's like not thick, but it's not thin either. Like it, it has, it's like substantial, but it's okay. You want to see it on because you need to see it on. It's so cute. Oh, it just feels silky when you put it on. It feels like like you shaved your legs and it's slippering on your, I don't know, <laughs> that is the worst, but it's just so slippery and smooth and I love it. Okay, here, this is how it looks. Isn't that so cute? This is the sleeve on it too, or the, okay. And then the bottoms, I would say if you're taller than 5'7", they might, feel a little bit short on you, but I'm five, seven and I feel like they fit perfect. So they have pockets. I will say I have some like this that are from Spanx 
and I love my Spanx ones. My only complaint with the Spanx was that they didn't have pockets. And these have pockets. So that's why I love them so much. They're smooth like butter. They're like, they have a sheen. They're so comfortable. I just think you're really gonna like them. Anyways, the white is beautiful. I have the gray. The gray's maybe a smarter choice because we're going into fall. I don't know, but I, I still thought the white was so pretty. I just love white though. Anyways, I thought that was another good one. <laughs> okay. And okay, this is another one. So I literally talked about this with Alyssa and my niece Kate yesterday, white after Labor Day. I'm just breaking the rules, okay? So um, yes, you could dress this set up too. I'm telling you, it's like, it, it has the sheen on it, like click on it. And if you wanna try the other colors, the other colors are good too. But I just, I think white's so pretty. But also we, we might wanna even have it next spring because you know sometimes in spring you wanna have the whites. Okay. So, okay, I have to talk about these. Um, it's the perfume. Okay, so I wanted, this all started because I was sharing Dime and Dime came out with rollers. And I was like, oh, I want the rollers to travel with. And then somebody messaged me and they're like, oh, you've got to get these. They sent me the link. So I bought them. I'm like, what? How they work, you guys, is like, so see the bottom right there? So you take the lid off of your perfume. You go pop, 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 and you just pump it. And it, the stuff goes inside. See how you can see there's... It doesn't leak out though. No, somebody said that the review said that they leaked. I have had no issues with mine. So, and I carry mine in my purse with me every day, everywhere I go. So it's not like it's just traveling one time to my destination. Like it travels with me every day. I love it. It's 589, you get three of them. And then that way you can put like three different fragrances or you can do the same fragrance in three different locations. But I freaking love this thing. I keep it in my, in my purse. Cause like sometimes, you know, when you go to a restaurant and after you leave, you like smell like the restaurant. So I really, really like that. Okay, and this is just another random thing that Gentry found of all things is because I'm like, I want a cute pill taker thing. This you could like put on your bed, like bed at night. Like I take magnesium every night. And um, so then you could just have it in there and then you just grab your little pills. Isn't that cute? And it magnets to the top. So anyways, I just thought that was another good one. And it's $8.99. Hey, it's 25% off. Gentry's not showing up on here today, and I feel like people are going to be really sad, Gentry. You don't <laughs> want to say hi to the people? <laughs> okay. Um, oh, this is another thing. This is one of my friends told me about these um, gel polish removers. So if you wanted to try that instead of soaking it in acetone, this just makes it like a cleaner, easier way to do it. My friend swears by that. And then um, the other thing is, is with the top and base coat, since they are the same size as the bottles, a lot of times you need extras of the top and base coat if you're gonna go through all of these, you know? So this is just like, and it's 41% off too. So if you need more top and base coat, that's a really great deal, you know? And then that was the last thing. So did anybody have any other questions? Can I answer any questions or we just call it good and then people can know how to do their nails now? because all the things are here, because I'm the nail pro. Just kidding, I'm not a nail pro. Anyway, thanks. Been doing the sourdough, yay! Okay, I'm so glad. It's so much easier. I feel like we hacked the system with the sourdough. We're hacking the system. <laughs> also, this is my husband's account. Um, we hacked the system with doing your nails because the thing is, is like to go get your nails done, you're gonna spend at least, I don't know, 50 to $150, I don't know but it seems like they're getting expensive. And then um, at least an hour, I swear, but doing your nails yourself, you can do it in 15 minutes. You can do it all the time, as much as you want. And they stay on, they look nice. Oh, I have to tell you one more thing about getting doing the gel on your nails is they, I noticed that I never get hangnails. As long as I have my gel on my nails, I don't get hangnails. But the second I have it off, I'll get hangnails. So if you start doing your nails, notice if you get hangnails or not. And you love picking those off. You love picking. I, I do like to pick off sometimes. I pick, Oh, what jeans do I have on today? I think these are from um, Altered State a couple years ago, maybe, maybe a year and a half ago. I'll show you what they look like. Not that we can link them here, but at least you'll know, you know? So pants set long. Okay. I would say the buttery pants are 
they fit me on 5'7", and I wear them high-waisted. So if you have, depends on if you have really long legs, I would say, oh, yay, your Betty's pillow's amazing. Oh, that makes me so happy. Anything you guys have for hang nails? My, I'm telling you, do your nails. Getting my nails in is so expensive, but thanks to you, I can do, yes, I'm, it, you guys, it's so much cheaper. It's way more efficient because you can do your nails in 15 minutes. I'm telling you, and my little hack, it makes a difference. And then, um, okay, wait, hang on. The, oh, okay, about the hangnails. Try doing your gel nails. I swear to you, it helps hangnails. Just try it. Um, the nail box comes with nail primer. Do you use it? I skipped it because I wasn't sure if I should. Oh, I actually don't use it, but you totally could. If your nails are like oily or if they're like having a hard time keeping the nail polish on, then I would try the primer. But if you don't, like I don't have any issues with mine and I, it comes off like in a week pretty easily. Like I can just peel it off and then it doesn't damage my nails. So just go like, it's kind of trial and error with, I don't want my wife judging me. Oh, <laughs> okay, wait, there's a Randy or a Robert. I'm so sorry. Um, you could do clear, you could do clear nails on your nails and see if that helps. Then your wife might be, maybe won't judge you. Um, use cuticle oil after doing nails, it will help with the hang nails too. Oh yeah, try the cuticle oil. Okay. All of the colors, but we'll try the alcohol. Yes, try the, okay, try the alcohol on it. And then we're Gentry. See Gentry, we needed a nail model. <laughs> um, okay, there was something else I was gonna show here, but now I can't remember what the question was. Okay, but I think we, hit, we, we got everything, right? Hey Gentry, if you'll do it, he'll do it. He might do Claire. <laughs> anyway, okay.